Easier to maneuver and maintain, smaller class BRVs are growing in popularity with both full-timers and weekend warriors. But some folks are still not ready to downsize from a class C or class A RV because at one time, smaller size meant decreased luxury and daily comforts like a dry bath. But not anymore. We are going to look at seven class B RVs that feature beautiful dry baths without compromising comfort or space. Let's dive in. Our top pick is the Arriva V24 from Coach House with its nice spacious layout. Though it doesn't have the slide out of the Atlas, it does a great job of providing ample living space while still incorporating a good sized private dry bath. Similar to the Atlas, the Arriva has a Mercedes-Benz Sprinter chassis with many luxury features. It has two twin sized beds that can fold into one king and lots of smart hidden storage. The dry bath includes a three quarter length closet as well as two medicine cabinets. One of the nicest features of the Areva is the larger window in the dry bath, which is in the exterior back door. It's tinted to allow for privacy while also allowing natural light in and helps create a more spacious feel. It also has a 31 gallon freshwater tank, which is a decent size for two people. Plus, they put the bath and beds at the rear, which is a nice break between the kitchen area and the bath area. The final selling point is that the Areva is a much more economical choice, though you don't feel like you're skimping on luxury at all. It's well-designed living space, full rear bath, and reasonable pricing make it our top choice. Next up, we have a really exciting RV. Technically, this RV is built on a Class C chassis, but it's considered a Class B+. It gives us just a little more space and power without compromising on the perks of a Class B. Plus, it's loaded with features including a power slide out, a Murphy sweet bed, and the best dry bath we've ever come across in a B+. This dry bath spans the entire rear of the RV. The shower is placed in the rear corner utilizing a curved shower door which allows for better arm movement compared to a narrow rectangular shower. It also has a tankless water heater which is a great perk. Despite the dry bath taking up so much space you'd hardly notice it thanks to the Atlas's smart design and use of a slide out. Another nice perk of the Atlas is the interior headspace of 6 foot 6 inches which also helps avoid that cramped feeling in the shower. You can customize the interior of this RV and they even have a special edition Tommy Bahama Atlas that has some lighter colored relaxing decor. There's also added perks like a built-in bar and special fabrics in line with the Tommy Bahama brand. This is definitely a luxury RV and its price tag reflects that so it might not be in everybody's price range. For people who do want a spacious dry bath and luxurious interior though, this should definitely be a contender. Next up is the Thor Motor Coach Compass 23TW or 23TE. These lesser known models don't really get enough credit. Both are considered Class B Plus models with a Ford chassis and come standard with all wheel drive, which is a little hard to come by in Class B RVs. It's a pretty major selling point, especially if part of what attracts you to Class Bs is their smaller size and their ability to take you more places. If boondocking is your thing, these are the models for you. The 23TW has a full wall slide out to expand the fold up queen size bed and featured kitchen. Tons of storage and a home like design really make the kitchen a highlight. The dry bath is compact but gets the job done. Though it doesn't have the spacious feel that the Atlas and Areva have, it does have a standing shower with a skylight, counter space, and a medicine cabinet. The dry bath is located in the rear left corner across from the bed, creating a more classic bedroom and suite feel. The Compass 23TW is a mid-range RV for your budget, making it a well-rounded contender, especially with that all-wheel drive. It has a gas engine compared to the Atlas and the Riva, which are both diesel. The Compass 23TE is just slightly smaller than the 23TW in that it doesn't have the full wall slide out. It's a half slide out to expand the Murphy bed and sofa. This also allows for the 23TE to have a larger dry bath taking up the full rear of the RV which provides for extra space, a linen closet, and a slightly larger shower. While the Thor Compass 23TW and 23TE may not have the luxury title that the Atlas and Areva have, you'd barely notice it from its features. They have a sleek, comfortable design for a home away from home feel. The models were built for visiting national parks, off-roading, and boondocking. Both have a tankless water heater and an outdoor shower. 
Nexus is the only Class B plus on this list to include a V8 engine. The Ford V8 7.3 liter chassis definitely helps it to stand out. Both the 25V and 27V have a slide out to accommodate a nice sized dinette and queen sized bed. The Viper is definitely designed with leisure in mind, whereas some of the other models on this list prioritize comfortable function over seating, the Viper includes oversized leather lounge chairs and has a spacious bedroom. Both the 25V and the 27V models have a dry bath with a good amount of storage and counter space. Both are a little tight but still provide comfortable environment with a roof vent, porcelain toilet, and shower skylight. Both have a 40 gallon water tank and an outdoor shower. Nexus also has the Viper 29V, which is the largest of the three Viper models, but still classified as a Class B+. The 29V has three slide out options for the queen bed, kitchen, and dinette. The main standout of the 29V compared to the 25V or 27V is the dry bath. They combine the bathroom features in the bedroom area to the rear of the unit. It has an end suite feel with a corner curved shower on one side and the toilet and sink fully enclosed on the other side. This is one of only two models on the list that has a shower separate from the toilet. Next up, the TRX is a nice, well-rounded Class B Plus RV with a Ford chassis. It has two floor plan options, one with a double sofa and one with a sofa and dinette. The TRX does not have a slide out and as a result has a very modest kitchenette with limited counter space but a good amount of storage. The TRX has a really nice dry bath. It's nestled in the rear corner and has cabinet storage below the sink and a medicine cabinet above. The shower is not too narrow and features a skylight. The TRX has a 26 gallon water tank which could be limiting depending on your usage. Next up, the Chinook Summit is a Class B Plus on a Ford Transit chassis. It's all-wheel drive and packs lots of storage throughout. Whereas some of the other models focus on living space features while your RV is parked, Chinook really focuses on comfort and simple design for when you're driving by, featuring dual-sided leather lounge seating. This could be a great option if you're looking for an RV more for driving long distances and occasional overnight parking instead of full-time RV living or driving with multiple passengers. Similar to the TRX, the Chinook's limitation is its bed. The seating folds out to uneven seams and not much padding. But its dry bath is quite nice with a lot of features to encourage home-like feel. It has an inset sink with a side medicine cabinet and storage below. It also features vanity lighting and a sleek tile backsplash. Like the Viper 29V, the Chinook also features the shower separate from the toilet and sink. The shower has chrome finishings and a dual shower head with a roof vent. It's a nice size as well and has a 30 gallon water tank. The Chinook Summit only started featuring the dry bath in the later models though, so purchasing new may be the only way to get it. While Winnebago does not currently produce any Class B RVs with a dry bath, they once did. The Era 70M was produced from 2017 to 2019 and included a great dry bath. There are still some Era 70Ms out there in the used RV market and you should definitely consider one if you find it. Winnebago is well respected and one of the most popular RV brands, especially for Class B and boondocking. So, it's a little disappointing that they have discontinued the dry bath option. In the Era 70M, the dry bath is a nice sized space that includes overhead cabinets and an extended countertop. The shower is a comfortable size with sliding fiberglass doors and inlay shelving. The mirror is also larger than most, covering the entire rear wall space. The Era 70M has a 44-gallon water tank, which is a great size to keep you comfortable for multiple days of off-grid camping. There's no official word on why Winnebago stopped producing the Era 70M, but rumor has it there were some issues with the slide-out for the Murphy bed, which would rattle while driving and become bothersome, especially since it's directly behind the driver's seat. Despite that rumor, there are still many used Era 70M RVs available, and they are popular. It's really an exciting time to get into the RV world. Just a few short years ago, there were only two Class B options with a dry bath. Now there are many more options that really help to make your RV a true home away from home. For those considering full-time RV living, the added comforts of a dry bath are incredibly valuable. 
We hope this list of some of the best dry bath options in Class B and Class B Plus RVs helps to get you excited while you continue your RV journey.